Welcome friends of Japanese art prints uh, for another edition of our video projection by Artelino. Well, first let me introduce myself. My name is Dieter von Schurer. I'm the owner and manager of the Artelino company. What's the Artelino company? Well, we sell Japanese art prints in weekly online auctions. A few weeks ago, we received a great consignment of Japanese Shin hunger prints. Really great, excellent, and among them very rare and of course also expensive pieces. And with this video, I'm going to introduce one. This is by Hazuri Kawase. The title is Namari Hot Springs. It shows a village in the countryside near one of these Japanese hot springs. Uh, in this case, it's in Namari. Well, Hazuri Kawase was born in 1883 and he died in 1957. And he was uh, the leading, one of the leading landscape printmakers of the Shinhanga art movement. Well, the Shinhanga art movement was something that took place in the first half of the 20th century, mainly. And nearly all prints um, created, designed uh, by Hazui Kawase, the artist, were published by Watanabe Shotsaburo. Watanabe Shotsaburo was the great mentor and the most important publisher for these Shin Hanga art prints. And Watanabe had his print shop in the middle of Tokyo, Ginza, and it was mainly an export business. At that time, the Japanese were not that much interested in Shin Hanga prints. Uh, and most of his prints went into the United States, uh, North America, a few also Europe, but the Americans were his main clients. Uh, they worked well during the 1920s and until the mid of the 1930s, but towards the end, uh, the reputation of Japan in the world became worse and worse. Japan's policy had become very aggressive. They attacked China. There was the terrible massacre in Nanjing and the relationship between Japan and the United States deteriorated more and more and it culminated by the uh, surprise attack uh, on Pearl Harbor in December of 1941. You American guys know that all very well. And the first air raid was the Doolittle air raid in April 1942 in Tokyo that did little damage, um, was more um, of a very important uh, political um, signal. Um, but after the Americans had conquered the first islands close enough to the Japanese mainland, then the air raids uh, started and intensified more and more and uh, life in Tokyo became more and more difficult. The Japanese in Tokyo could afford or had relatives in the countryside. They left Tokyo or they um, were evacuated and the Watanabe print shop the Watanabe family left and all employees, but only one man, uh, a printer with the name of Ono Gintaro, he remained in Tokyo and guarded the Watanabe print shop and produced on a very, very low uh, level, continued to produce woodblock prints. And this is one of these, was created and published in 1943. Um, and therefore it's very, very rare. It's not only the threat of bombing raids in Tokyo, but also the resources were very rare. Even paper was rationed and um, yeah, a terrible time. Uh, I'm now going to explain to you these the meaning of these Japanese characters here on the left margin, on, on the right margin, like this, you can identify them and you can also recognize that this was printed by Ono Gintaro. Um, I assume you don't speak Japanese and you cannot read um, Japanese and quite honestly at this opportunity I admit myself I'm not capable of reading Japanese, but I'm married to a Japanese wife 
an American Japanese wife because she has the American citizenship. Her name is Yuri and she makes the great descriptions that you can read in our weekly online auctions with our online catalogs. Okay, let's start here on the left margin. Well, here on top, this says Iwate Ken, that means Iwate province, and Onsen. Onsen is the Japanese word for hot spring. And down here, you this says show, made in the 18th year of Showa. What is Showa? Showa is an expression from the Japanese calendar. The Japanese calendar um, identifies itself by the ruling of the Japanese emperor in the Showa period that went from 1926 until 1989. Yeah, this emperor lived for quite a long time. And the 18th year of Showa is 1943. Let's go to the right bottom. Um, there on, this is the Watanabe uh, copyright seal, which was used from 1942 until 1945. And here, the lower characters, this is the name of the printer. The first character is Ono, Ono is the family name, and here, Gintaro. Well, this proves clearly that this is a very rare print. Uh, today is September 1st, no, tomorrow is September 1st, and tomorrow ends this auction where we present this very, very rare print. Would be nice to see you in our auction, and would be nice to see you for our next video. And by the way, something else, Ortolino does not buy prints, yeah? We do not have a stock of our own. We operate like a real auction house, Sotheby's or Christie's, but we are much smaller, small family operation. And, but we sell real consignments. And these consignments come from collectors or dealers, uh, sometimes also from contemporary artists. And of course, it's important for us that we permanently get very, very good consignments. So if you're a collector and want to sell your collection, Go to Ortolino, contact us in English. And if you're a dealer in the US, contact us. And if you're a dealer in Japan and cannot read or write English, you can contact us in Japanese. Yeah, we would be pleased to get your consignments. And for now, uh, have a good time. Thanks for watching. Goodbye.